All right, guys. So welcome back to this. We're going to do this again. We're going to try to do this a lot on stream, guys. It's where we go in depth into some of my clips and some games. And I'm going to give you guys some tips and tricks on how to improve your gameplay in Apex Legends. We're going to go ahead and jump over to the clip. We're not going to watch the whole clip. I'm going to skip ahead to the part that's key important today's topic is going to be armor swapping you guys have seen me do it a ton i know you guys see pros do it i know um it's just a really good pro tip for the game okay so in this particular instance we're right outside of capital city fighting it's me and my nephew don we're going to play and i want to show you a precise moment on how to armor swap this is something that you can use in every aspect of your game, especially in intense situations. One of the biggest things I love about Apex Legends is that when you down or kill somebody, or when you down, when you kill somebody and you get their box, if you take their armor, it's full armor. As opposed to some other games like um, PUBG is a big one. If you crack their armor or even Blackout, if you, if you deal enough damage to the armor and you armor swap there, it, you just get it damaged. So it's not fully regenerated. In Apex, when you armor swap, you get a brand new set of armor at full health. Okay, so in this, this is what we're going to do. We're going to watch this clip, this part on this clip, and then I'm going to break down how important it is to armor swap. Okay, so we're just going to walk through this. Uh, I'm going to skip ahead. So right here, right there's a team that's about to pop up right here, guys. I want to show this to you. One minute. Right? Timer's coming down. There's bodies there. Right? Let's skip ahead. Okay, so here goes these two guys. Two guys. I got purple armor. My nephew's healing, right? So I hit him. He's got purple armor. Okay? I'm okay for now. Lifeline's got purple armor. Thank you. I'm going to armor swap again. Okay. So that's the part of the clip I want to show you guys. Now let's break it down, okay? So you guys saw that I got a full set of armor, right? Full set, brand new armor. It's awesome, right? So let's go through the clip again. So I know it's, it's, it's two players, right? There's two of them. So I just shot the caustic. He's got purple armor, okay? I don't I lost him right here. I lost him. I see the lifeline. Okay. Get my reload off. The lifeline's pushing me. I don't know what kind of armor she has. I start to shoot her. She's got purple armor. Okay, you guys can see that. Purple armor. Okay, cool. Need help on this I freaking line? shred her. She destroys my armor. If you guys can see this down here, destroys my armor. I get help back up from my nephew. We down her. Thank you. Now, I still don't know where the caustic is, and this is where that situational awareness comes in, and we're going to talk about that in another tips and tricks video. But my only goal right now is because I don't have any batteries, it's going to take longer for me to heal or run and hide and heal instead of just armor swapping. So what I try to do is try to finish her armor swap before the caustic comes up and re-engages. Because I got to assume that at this point, because of how much damage I dealt the caustic, he's somewhere healing up his armor. And he's doing it the slow way, like one shield cell at a time. Because if it would have been a battery, he would have been back already. So instead, I just we finish her off. Armor swap again. I call out armor swap. I get the armor swap, and then boom, we're off to the races, okay? So now we still, the caustic threw just through an ultimate. Just through an ultimate. I believe it was an ultimate, so that's where I got the gas Wrap from. As well. He threw grenades. I'm taking a grenade He's shot, and I lose my armor again. But I want to stress how important it is for armor swapping. So there goes the caustic. The caustic, I just saw it right there. If you guys look right here, here goes the caustic. Or no, that's the lifeline, I believe. Yeah, that's the lifeline. I'm okay for now. So in this fight, after we knock down... After we knock the lifeline here, if that caustic would have been at full health and he's here on us, I'm in a very dangerous spot. I have no armor. Thank you. But armor swapping. I'm going to armor swap again. Right, my teammates got my back. Right, I armor swap. And boom, we're out of there like, you know, we're out of there. So, guys, I want to stress how important it is to armor swap. Only if you have the opportunity, you got to understand that awareness of when it's important to armor swap or when is it important to back off and heal, which I have as another tips and tricks video. Okay. So armor swapping, put it in your book of plays, book of moves, 
whatever you want to call it. Armor swapping is a huge thing in Apex Legends. I'm, I'm sure you've seen me do it. I'm sure you've seen a lot of people do it, but I wanted to touch on it. In these tips and tricks videos, they're going to be bouncing all over the place. They're in no set order. It's just a topic that's relevant that comes up. And we're going to do it here live on stream. And then we're going to use it in our gameplay. I hope you guys can get used to using it so that way you can stay in the gunfight. Fast armor swapping can continue to help your team as opposed to being off healing. There's all different types of situations. There's times to do that. But armor swapping is very fast. It's very quick. You just pop swap armor, get back in the fight, help your team win a gunfight, and then you can loot the rest of the items. So if you guys did enjoy this video, make sure to drop a like as always. If you're new to this to the YouTube channel, hit that subscribe button, turn on notification bells, guys, as always. Stay gaming. I'm out, guys. Peace. Come.